This is Ashwin from VisitTemples.com and today I'm going to take you all to a beautiful temple in Andhra Pradesh. On the way to this temple there is a huge painted welcome arch that leads us into the temple. Sri Penuzila Lakshmi Narasimha Swami Temple is located in Penchalakona of Nellore District, Andhra Pradesh. The presiding deity is Sri Lakshmi Narasimha Swami who is an incarnation of Lord Vishnu. The main deity is Aswam Kumurthi and is also called as Chatravati Narasimha Swami or Samasila Narasimha Swami. In this temple Lord Lakshmi Narasimha Swami blesses his devotees along with his consort goddess Chenchu Lakshmi here. The name Penuzila Lakshmi Narasimha Swami of this temple is derived since the idol of Lord Narasimha Swami is kept over the rock. The temple is regarded as one of the Nava Narasimha Shethram. The temple was built on the banks of river Kondalura and there is a huge waterfalls originating from this river and is eye catching. This temple has a shrine with huge idol of Lord Garudan and a separate shrine for Lord Anjaneya Swami is built straight opposite to the shrine of presiding deity Lord Penuzila Lakshmi Narasimha Swami. The shrine for goddess Chenchu Lakshmi is built on a nearby steep hillock and devotees can access the goddess shrine using the well-maintained steps by foot. This temple also has an idol for Lord Krishna and Lord Krishna is seen dancing along with five-headed dreadful Kalingan snake after capturing it. There is a sacred tank in this temple and devotees are allowed to have a holy dip. And it is believed that taking a holy dip in this temple's sacred tank will cure all ailments of any devotee. To reach this temple either from the district headquarters at Nellore or from nearby Chennai city from Tamil Nadu one has to pass through roads cutting across dense forest areas, night traveling after dusk or sunset in these areas either by foot or by a two-wheeler is unsafe for anyone since the forest has a few wild animals too, and the forest department of Andhra have displayed billboards.
This temple has few mandapams which could be used at different special occasion. Devotees can also use this mandapam for taking rest after their long journey to this beautiful temple. There are a row of petty shops and eateries. The entire temple complex with the backdrop of the hilly mountain terrain is picturesque and a treat to watch for any devotee.